Hi guys, today in my Collector's Guide series we'll be taking a look at the Japanese version of Crash Bandicoot 2, Cortex Strikes Back. There are two variants, the regular dual case version and another version which I'll get into shortly. There's a Japanese spelling of the game there. And the English version, it does say Coltex instead of Cortex but every version says this just may be a translation error. Crash 2 comes with a manual, game disc, spine card and a couple of inserts. This is the spine card. And if you're looking for a sealed copy this is what it looked like with the spine card on the case. That's the game disc. I'll quickly take it out, show the, the art on the back. Again, this was another sealed copy which I opened a num number of years ago. the manual and there's a couple of inserts which I have to slid in here you have one for PlayStation Club one which shows off the moves Crash can do in the game And another one which is for a music CD which you can occasionally find on Yahoo at auctions or Macari. I'll just put, put this away and get into the other variant. Now in terms of the other variants, I have never seen this one actually sealed, but it has a, this 3D lenticular card similar to how the NTS American version of Crash 2 has. It's not as, um, the movement is not as good as what the American version has, so let's see if the camera can, can pick it up, can do just slightly. Well, what is this actually? Well it's actually a calendar for the year 1998 with the not for sale writing just there. And it's quite, um, I think it's a lot thicker than um, the 3D card that you get with the American version. So I'm pretty sure, again, pre-order bonus or a store exclusive, but again, I've never seen this inside a sealed version before. But it comes like slipped in front of the manual, just like that. So that's just a quick and simple guide to complete inbox copy of Crash Bandicoot 2 Cortex Strikes Back Japanese version. Hope you found this guide helpful. Thank you for watching.